Hi, this is Joe coming back to you with more communication tips that I learned from my kids. We've already talked about committing to your goals. We've talked about getting someone's attention. Now, I want to talk a little bit more about the message. And today's episode is called Help. There's a strange man following us. My daughter, Kayla, my youngest, was walking with my wife and my daughter, Olivia, through a mall. I was walking slowly behind them because that's just what I do. They turned the corner to go to an anchor store and they passed by a jeweler's. They went out of my sight for about four or five seconds. And as I approached the turn, a police officer appeared blocking my path. Literally stood, just came out from behind the wall and stood right in front of me. I stopped, I was startled, and then I recognized the officer. And at the same time, he recognized me. I said, hello, Officer Smith. And he looked at me and went, Joe, and then looked back over his shoulder. And my wife and daughters were walking and my daughter Kayla was just laughing. When they turned the corner and left my sight, Kayla looked up at the police officer and she said to the police officer, help, there's a strange man following me. Well, the officer jumped into action. He jumped into action because he figured it was his chance to save the day. But really what happened was my daughter spoke to his purpose. He was there to provide security to the mall. My little girl at about four years old looked up at that officer and knew why he was there and spoke directly to his purpose. And it made him go into action. He had no idea what was coming around that corner. He had no idea what was happening next. But no, Officer Rick Smith posed himself in between me and my family because my daughter said help. There's a strange man following us. He, she made her statement very relevant to the listener. She spoke to his purpose. She spoke to his goals. She spoke to exactly why he was there. So when you message and you speak to people and you communicate with them, do you speak to their purpose? Do you speak and give them meaning? Do you speak in a way that makes them know that they are inspired to action. That's my goal for you this week, is to ask you to focus in this message. I want you to focus on delivering a message that speaks to someone's purpose.